2022, the African nation of Uganda, dozens of children have been attacked, many of them eaten by chimpanzee, and no one is talking about it. Habitat loss. Human settlements encroaching upon the protected chimpanzees' homes, and these battles are intensifying. Two dozen attacks that are recorded, many more go unreported. As always, don't take Uncle Creature's word for it. Go over to Uncle Google if you trust him more. You'll see the truth of what I'm saying. The boys were in the village playing with a soccer ball that they had made of tape and other old discarded items. They were enjoying themselves under the hot African sun, kicking up dust, giggling and laughing. The laughter soon turned to screams. One of the boys had went to retrieve a ball near the edge of the village, quite close to the forest. When it happened, there was a scream from the young man and then an answering scream from the chimpanzees. They descended on him and attacked. There was nothing that could be done. They drug him into the forest. I've had a lot of videos taken down recently, so I have to be very careful how I attempt to tell you what happened next. As is often the case, the children were calling for the adults. They wanted their mommies and their daddies. When the mommies and daddies finally came and entered into the forest, they were horrified to discover that the chimpanzees had torn the child apart. They had fed upon him, and they weren't through. The chimpanzees then came for the adults. One of the men was pulled to the ground. He was emasculated. His fingers and toes were bitten off, as was his nose. By the time the others had arrived, it was too late for him and they did all that they could. They ran. It was a year of bloody warfare. An attack by the chimps led to a wholesale slaughter by the humans, poisoning, snaring, and using weapons, destroying every chimp that they could find. But still, the attacks continue. The most horrifying thing, despite the fact that no one's talking about it, is this. The chimpanzees are hunting children. They are still lurking and waiting for children. The chimps are running out of refuge and they're fighting back. Whose fault is it?